Misuse of a disability blue badge. Drop the shanks, arts for banks. I just came out the, the Woolwich Centre. We had an interview with the fraud team regarding a misuse of a disability blue badge. It's not usually the fraud team that's, um, that deals with these interviews, but now they're up in the ante. They're now um, trying to prosecute you for more serious offences. Um, well, it's the fraud team dealing. They want to um, prosecute you when using these disability badges now for um, fraud, um, fraud by false representation, or even handling stolen goods, which is much more serious than the offence of misuse of a blue badge. Why is this? Because they can fine you more. So bigger the offence, the bigger the fine. Went in there today, done what we needed to do. Strong prepared statement. I'm advising everyone, if you're getting these letters through the post and they want you to come in for a voluntary interview for these disability blue badges, do not take it lightly. It's a serious interview. It's an interview under caution, the same as at the police station. It just The difference is you're not under arrest and you will get a criminal record if you're found guilty. And if you go in there without a legal representation, you're wide open. Please, if you receive one of these letters, contact me or get legal representation. Do not go into the interview alone. They try to play it down and they say to you, it's not a serious interview, you're not under arrest, you can leave at any time. Um, we just want to ask you a few questions. Before you know it, you're in front of the magistrates, you've got a criminal record. You don't want a criminal record for fraud or handling stolen goods, believe me. Inbox me if you get one of these letters or if you want any advice. Be safe, be legal.